Hello, how are you? My name is Choki Lubis and now I'm at Prodaling Serpong, Indonesia. And today I'm going to make a review of a bicycle that is so complete. Stay tuned until the end of the video and don't forget to subscribe. This is the bike. This is Polygon Haze X7. As we all know, Polygon is the top of mind if we talk about bicycle in Indonesia. This time, Polygon came out with a new special species. It's a hybrid urban bike. So, what is hybrid urban bike? Hybrid urban bike is a bicycle that is comfortable to use in the city, whether it's bike to work or just a coffee ride on the weekend. Now, aside from its comfortness, this bike also really really tough it can handle some off-road stuff how come how can it be so complete so let's break it down let's do quick specification check of this polygon haze x7 now let's start from the frame this bike made from aluminium rl6 frame known by its lightweight and robustness it has two sets of mounting for bottle cages and also it has true axle system on it this bike has all the size that you need from small until extra large so it can accommodate all range of riders and for the colors this bike only have one option it's black gold as we seen for me i really like this color what about you do you like this color for the fork, Polygon Haze X7 is using fork from Suntour. As we know, Suntour is a brand that produces bicycle suspension from Japan. And it's been in the bicycle industry for more than 30 years. So there's no doubt about the quality of this fork. This bike uses Suntour NCX Air with 63mm of travel. It might not be the deepest suspension travel for a bike. But it's enough, even when you push it through some off-road track. Now, let's check the wheelset and the braking system. For the rim, Polygon Haze X7 is made of double-wall alloy rims, with tires from WTB Riddler 700x45C. The thread is not too thick so it's still good to ride on asphalt road then the braking system of this bike uses a shimano mt400 hydraulic disc brake well i can say this is one of the good braking system that available in the market okay into the cockpit this polygon haze x7 use a handlebar from NTT Expert 720mm wide and the stem is also from NTT Expert with a length of 90mm now let's go to the most important part the group set this Polygon Haze X7 use shifter and rear derailleur from Shimano SLX 1x11 speed if we compare, this Shimano SLX is on the professional level of Shimano Group Set chart. The cassette is from Sunrays with combination of 1146T. And this bike also used single chain ring 36T.
This Polygon Haze X7 is really aiming into a comfortable ride. Our body set in an upright position, so we can pay attention to the traffic around us. It's ideal for riding in the city that have such traffic like Singapore or Jakarta. The gear shift is also quite smooth. I can say this gear combination is really fit this bike. We can be flexible on uphill or straight roads. Then, how does it perform off the road? Well, we know that this bike has a mountain bike DNA on its frame. It's really tough and perform well off the road. Even though the suspension is not traveling too deep, it can still absorb all the shock from the track really well. Okay, we are down to the end of the video. In my opinion, this bike is great for cruising the city. Its comfort riding position makes it agile for the urban street. And all the specs that we talk about, it really support its ability when you push it to the off-road track. Now, let me hear it from you. Do you like this bike or not? And if you have any other question about this bike or any other Polygon product, please write them in the comment below. I'm sure the Rodeling team will be more than pleased to help you. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the, another video.